So, um, this video won't be covering a topic in particular. I just want to talk about some shit I've been noticing here on my Facebook page. Pause for the calls. If you're not following me on Facebook, you bullshit, right? Um, a couple things been happening over here. Anybody that's following me um, on Facebook been seeing me posting pictures up of, you know, people with their fist up. You know, black people with their fist up, white people with their fist up. You know, and I made the video power to my people, and I think that, you know, a lot of people don't watch those videos. Um, a lot of people don't watch the videos I make. And they sit around and be shocked at the things that I post. This happens all the time. And what happens here is if you're going to do this, then when you see a picture with a white person with their fist up, then you automatically got a problem with me. I'm on some coon shit. You letting integration, you integrating white people into a black people's movement. Y'all not paying attention to what the fuck I'm saying. I'm going to be exposed. You know, all these things like y'all not paying attention. You can't expose a person who says exactly what their intent is. How can you expose a person like that? It's mind blowing to me. Black people get mad. It's fucking me all the time, you know. Call me all these names. I didn't, and then the, the the weirdest shit is you. I'll have black people here, and then I have white people who say that I'm racist against white people for talking about black people shit. I get it from both sides. I get it from both fucking sides. Y'all have that in common. You don't even know it. What I want people to understand. Is I'm not trying to be like anybody else. People want to tell me, you know, what the mistakes that, that Martin Luther King made, what the mistakes were that the Black Panthers made, what the mistakes were that Malcolm X made. Like, and every one of the stories, it involves, you know, integration, letting white people get close and fuck up, you know, what was going on. And if you pay attention to the history, the true history, a lot of times when black people's movements are you know, you know, basically a bamboozling is infiltrated. It's by another black person. It's by another black person that has been sent by the white man. White man sent them, but the person is black. What, I don't, I don't know why people try to be so enlightened and so on a pro-black and come at me when y'all don't even understand the history here. It's okay if I post pictures of all the black people with their fist up. No one questions that. It's okay. This fist means black power. But all those black people are cool because they're black. If I post pictures of somebody white doing this shit, oh my God, it's crazy. But I told y'all it was power to my people. People that can see the truth. People that understand what's going on out here in every way, not just one way, not just about what black people are going through, not just about that. That counts to me, especially with me being a black man. That counts. I'm going to talk about that. Y'all see me talk about these things. I'm going to talk about it. That's not all that's going on. And if a white person can't see that. See what I'm talking about and fuck with that and fuck with me talking about, you know, the 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 situation that's going on, the conspiracies against black people that have been against black people since we got here at the hands of the white man. Then there's no need. Some white people can see what the fuck's going on out here. There are a lot of black people that can't see what's going on out here, but they automatically OK. Because they skin color. People won't understand me. And I don't mind that. Like I don't, I don't make these videos. I don't come to anybody like yo. Can I make a video? Or can I? Do you mind if I post? Like can I post white people's? Or can I, do you mind if I post it? I don't ask for y'all's fucking permission. So when you disapprove of it. I don't care. I didn't ask for your permission. You have to understand that. I don't care about what the fuck y'all want to do. If you want to do your do your own thing, have your own page, have your own channel, talk about whatever the fuck you want to, post whatever the fuck you want to. This is a free country, so to speak. You can do whatever you want, but disagreeing with what I'm doing and my motives and you know, you, oh, you just a stupid motherfucker and you ignorant ass nigga and da, 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 like, 
That don't even make sense to me. This is about black peoples. This is black people that act like that. Mad at me because I see both pictures. Like, because I see shit. I, I see all of it. Because I see the shit in 3D. And what y'all have to understand is when it comes time, you think that they building FEMA camps for just black people? Are we that ignorant? Do you think that? Really, you can, if, you, if you believe that, you can say that. Those are specifically made to put black people in. When they initiate martial law, it'll be only for black people. Y'all can't believe that. When shit get real, it's not going to matter. It's not going to matter. Whatever color jersey you got on, you on the same team if you riding in the same direction. It don't matter. Black people have to become something that people want to stand with. That's what made other races of people want to stand with other, you know, black movements. Because we were worthy. We looked powerful standing together. Anybody will want to be a part of that. Anybody will want to come tear that down as well. It's too powerful. Especially, you know, oh shit, it's not just black people. They got some white peoples over there, some Chinese people over there. And they all talking about real shit. What can we do about this? This is a problem. They unifying. They talking. This is a problem. And people continue to get mad at me. And I don't understand it. Because I'm not making anybody be a part of what I'm, what I'm, I mean, what I am. I don't make people be a part of this. If you fuck with me, I fuck with you. That's humanity to me. In my opinion, that might be crazy to some of y'all. Like, it's almost like people don't like the fact that I have my own ideas. They want me to pattern myself after somebody else. Being unique is negative. But that's the same shit that these other people had to go through that came before me. Being unique is negative. Somebody's not going to like it. And I don't give a fuck if y'all like it or not. And we talking about pictures. I mean, it's, it's funny to me that, that we dealing with just pictures here. Black folk acting like I done made them, you know, white people the, the, the president and vice president of my movement or some shit like that. Ain't nobody. It, my movement is it's just me right here. I ain't got no fucking organization building and white people running it and no shit like ain't no shit going on like that. But that's almost what black people make it seem like off of a white person having the bravery enough to put their fucking fist up on a black man's page. Take some bravery. A lot of these white folk families, even if they not racist as hell, a lot of them families is racist as hell. They would just own the fuck out of them for even associating with or understanding anything that happens with black people. I'm not out here to be understood by y'all. I'm not having a fucking... There's no popularity contest that I'm running here. I speak what's true to me. And I suggest you do the same thing. Coming to my page... And y'all be seeing them on Facebook. Like, just going ham about what I should be doing. And what the white man done did. And how you shouldn't allow, you know, white people to put their fucking fist up in a picture. A picture. You shouldn't allow that. It's my page. Understand that. It's my movement. Understand that. It has nothing to do with you unless you want to be a part of it. If not, do your own thing. As long as we go on in the... I, I, I just want us to be going in the same direction. I don't care what your methods are. I could care less what anybody's methods are. As long as we move in the same direction, fighting against the same type of oppression. Us black folk, we're going to have to build first. So that's when you white people come to me and want to tell me how to be black. I don't fucking pay you no attention. I just got through going through that shit today in my message box. Because I posted some shit about Hidden Colors 3 coming out. 
White people, oh, that's racist. You one of the white motherfuckers I can't fuck with. Because you denying the truth to promote unity. That's not what the fuck I'm going to do. I'm going to speak the truth and promote unity at the same time. Racism exists. I'm not going to fucking ignore it. For you white people, it's not going to fucking happen. I'm going to tell y'all that shit again. And for you black people, I'm not going to be racist towards every white person that can see and understand what the fuck I'm doing. Fuck both of y'all. Like, really. Fuck both of y'all. I can't give it to you no other way. For anybody that's going to continue to support my movement, I do appreciate it. I love seeing these pictures. I posted about it the other day on Facebook. Like, seeing these pictures, like, that shit does something for me. It motivates me. Seeing people be different, even for a second, even if for a click, just the, as long as it takes to take that picture, even if you're only different in that moment, that's a start. That's better than little girls running around twerking. That's better than niggas taking pictures of their fucking money on the goddamn, you know. It's better than that. It's a start. What the fuck? Y'all mad at that? You're not influencing people to do anything great. You're not doing anything. But coming to hate on me. For what? For what? Power to my people. People that's down the ride. People who understand. It don't matter what jersey color you got on with them FEMA camps. When they come with them big ass trucks. Military buying all that ammo that's just for black people. Really? <laughs> we a minority. You make up 13%. You think they buying up all that ammo just for black people? I'm going to tell this white man to get the fuck out of here. Get your gun out of here. I don't need your firepower when it comes time for it. Do you know how to build a little camp or some shit like that? Okay, you got a skill. All right. Well, you can ride with me. I don't know how to build that. I don't know how to do that. Y'all don't understand. I do. And if you don't understand, if you got a problem with it, and fuck you. Shrug life. That's it. I appreciate y'all. It took time out to watch this video. I know it wasn't coming to a particular topic or anything like that, but I just feel like I had to say that shit. Like, I don't I don't know why people be so fucking mad at what the fuck I'm doing with my own movement. When well, you can have your own movement. But you ain't got the power to move nobody, do you? That's your problem. It's a weakness in yourself. So are you mad at me? Really? Because you'll smile for your white manager. You don't go put your fist in his face, black power. No, 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 no. You're not going to act like that. You're going to act proper in front of that white man. That's your boss. You're cool for him. But then come at me. That makes sense. Cool for politicians. But be mad at me. Y'all understand that? You think Barack got in office with only the uh, uh, black vote? <laughs> I mean, granted, then we know that, you know, the whole shit is a sham anyway, but white people voted for that nigga. Yeah. Might be regretting it now, because it really, it really didn't matter whether you, you know, whether you voted for him or not, he was going to be president regardless, but white people voted for that nigga. How many truly racist motherfuckers voted for Barack? You know, white people just watching this video. Truly racist. How many Klansmen voted for Barack? I'm going to say not many. <laughs> Shit crazy to me. Bottom line is, fuck you if you don't fuck with me. Easy. That's all it is to it. Power to my people. Fuck the other side. I'm out.